My name is Sean Williams. I am the founder and executive director of Coastside Reef Soccer. Um, the organization was founded in 2004 um, with an effort, um, emphasis on providing services to low to moderate income children and those from underserved communities. So with the demographics that we serve, the primary reason that there's a, such a need on the physical fitness side is that the lack of activity um, the, that may be available to them within walking or biking distance of their homes. And so we are able to organize um, events for them to be able to get out and be active. One of the things that has, has definitely been evident is, uh, and we get the comment a lot from parents, that, um, well, we want them to participate because the only thing they do is play the video games all day. One of the great things that we've seen through our program is that because of the physical activity and because we create such a fun environment for them to be able to participate in, that our children do less of the gaming and they spend more time and want to spend more time outdoors, uh, whether that be with us playing soccer, or walking around um, one of the trails that we have, going kayaking. Uh, we just started a natural science STEM program. So we are getting them outdoors. We are getting them away from the game systems and, and they're figuring out the things that they enjoy and, and the enjoyment that they have being and socializing with others um, in that environment. Our youngest group of four-year-olds come, uh, come into what we call our academy program. And one of the things that we emphasize with families as they get involved with us is that we want to stay involved with their child until they graduate high school and some children even come back to us after um, graduation um, to be able to provide that assistance and guidance that they need. So our success has been based on really uh, staying in the child's life and taking a child for seeing that child for who they are at this time, but then also helping them to develop some and set some goals uh, through our experiences and through the exposure that they gain through our programming. Uh, most recently, in, uh, we've just had our two um, graduates from, from college to earn their bachelor's degrees. Um, and we are seeing kids that have now played on a national team, as well as we have two players that are currently playing on the ODP team. So through that, we've seen the, that success. Um, and also on the academic side, our, kid, our children have come through our program have completed over 200 credit hours um, at college before, they, before high school graduation. So not only are we helping them to develop on the field and seeing the success, we also seeing that off the field. So the community benefits when we invest in our youth. And a child's financial status should not determine the opportunities that they have in life, uh, nor should it also then limit their voice, but we should um, be empowering them to find their voice, to identify the passions that they have. And through Coast Art Reach Soccer, they're able to do that, whether that's soccer, whether that's in academics, or whether that's service to the community. And so what we're seeing and what we're asking at this time is for that you to invest into our program for you to for for those that are able to to determine how do they want to impact the lives of our community and, and enable us to be able to continue to reach children um, that we are currently serving and to provide all the program support that they need in order for them to develop and grow. Coast Highway Soccer future for for me is being able to build out in all of the programs that we have, the soccer, the sports analytics program, the CAD program, the gaming and 3D um, design program that we have, the having a natural science lab, having a robotics labs. So we see that all of the things that we have thought about for the last three to four years, we see that we're in a, in a place now that we are ready to implement all those programs across the board, um, being able to launch our entrepreneur and incubator system so that we are helping our young people and supporting them that want to be um, entrepreneurs and own small businesses as well. Together, let's impact the children's lives.